the, the other ones. So I'm going to be teaching you guys accounting this year. Uh, I've been teaching the subject since 2015. Uh, this is for grade 11 and 12 only class. Uh, this is uh, a non-external uh, course. So this is not, you're not going to take any external exams on it, uh, like an ACD or something like that, So or AP. Uh, this is for your knowledge, and if you are a business major, this is going to be very beneficial because this this uh, it, uh, this book and this course is going to be talking about uh, the actual first year of college in uh, wherever you go. If you're taking an accounting, you need to know all those basic knowledge. Uh, since you're going to be uh, taking this class with me, that will be definitely the first time you're going to be hearing uh, uh, things about accounting. It has because nobody has a background. In, in schools or in high schools about accounting. So this is your first class uh, in our school. So all of you will be on the same level. Uh, so, but it's gonna be fun. You're gonna like it. Uh, with time, you're gonna enjoy the class. So this is your book. This is what's gonna be the book that you're gonna be using. Okay, so this is a book that, you know, if you noticed, it says first year course. So this is actually what they use in college. It doesn't have to be the exact, exact book, but this is what could be the book itself, all right? So let's go ahead and just give you an idea. Uh, we mentioned that it's not externals. Uh, this is uh, in 11th and 12th grade. So here we have, this book has a 29 chapters, but definitely we're gonna, not gonna be able to take all 29. Even if, in if you are in college, you're not gonna be all the 20, uh, you're not gonna take all the 29 chapters. Uh, you're gonna be taking the major chapters and all that. So, for example, in, in our course here, I, I need to skip certain uh, core, uh, chapters. Uh, for example, like chapter one, I need to, uh, to skip it. Uh, I usually leave it till the end of the year at, after, after you have an idea because it talks about jobs, opportunities and job uh, careers and all that. So I'm gonna leave it till uh, the end of the year. So this way you'll have an, a knowledge of what accounting is. And then you'll decide, for example, if you're grade 12 and you want to go into business, uh, majoring and all that. So it's, at least you have an idea uh, what accounting is. Okay, now let's go ahead and, and just start mentioning chapters. For example, chapter two is going to be talking about the word of business. Uh, then you're going to be talking, like I said, all what you're going to be hearing on this video is not no details. I'm not doing any details of explaining any accounting. Uh, um, ideas and all that, but just to give you an idea that uh, what accounting is, we're going to be talking about businesses, transactions, uh, something called an accounting equation. Uh, we're going to be talking about uh, assets. Probably you heard the word assets, liabilities, owner, owner capital. Some of them you're going to be having. You, you probably will be hearing for the first time. Some you probably heard about it before, but you know we're going to go details in, in class. Uh, and I promise you, uh, you're going to enjoy the class. I mean, as, if you stay with it and you keep, you know, uh, reading and you keep uh, uh, following uh, the, inf the information I gave you, uh, worksheets, uh, the study guides and all that, you're going to be doing very, very well. Uh, and you're going to enjoy it because you're going to be learning things that you never, ever heard about before. Okay, that's one of the courses in, in all those years of in high school that you'll probably be taking that you probably had zero knowledge of. Anything else, you probably had some idea about it uh, some way or another, but with, when it comes to accounting, probably uh, that's a new, a new thing for you guys, okay? Uh, that's mainly what's going to be in the course. Uh, the course, uh, they're going to be divided into like, like the two terms, term one and term two. So term one, uh, we're going to have, we're gonna have uh, let's say, around... Uh, uh, 10 chapters in it, okay, 10 to, to 9, it depends on the timing, it depends on what, what, how we can do things, uh, but usually I start with chapter 2, and I go all the way to chapter 10, I don't want to go below that, so definitely, because it's all connected, so from chapter 2 all the way to chapter 10, it, it's going to be done together, I cannot leave it till the second term, uh, because this is what we talk about the accounting cycle. So we have to do the cycle within a term by itself. And then we're going to, then after the end of the term, you know that you're going to be taking final exam. And then we are going to be moving to term two. Uh, term two, it has a, a different uh, chapters involved. I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to be skipping certain chapters. 
okay because i can't and no way i could do 29 chapters okay no 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 one could do 29 not not in college not in not in high school you cannot do it in in one this is actually this book is being taught uh, over two two courses in in college so uh, accounting 101 accounting 102 will be covering the whole book so that's what we did in college when i took it uh usually a, a one book will be divided over two two uh, semesters okay so but here we try and we're going to try our best to take the most important ones the, the 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 details that you need to know so if you go to college you'll be sitting in a classroom where you know you see things it won't be the first time so but maybe the the, the guy next to you or the whoever's next to you probably will be hearing those things for the first time uh, but on uh, like in our school, at least he has he got the advantage of taking a course that not too many people will take, and it's a must course by the way. If you're a business major, you have to take it. So there's no way you're going to be majoring in account, uh, sorry, in in business and not taking an accounting course. Okay, so that's that's the the beauty about it. So you go to college with with a lot of knowledge uh, with you. So. Let's go ahead and just keep on going and showing you. Uh, like I said, you're going to be seeing things here on this video for the first time. You're not going to understand what does it mean. We're talking about purchases. We're talking about, uh, you know, selling items. There's rules for, you know, how to do the purchases. There's rules how to do the selling. Um, and uh, also, we're going to be talking about something called special journals, uh, worksheets, uh, the 10-column worksheets, and we have, the uh, you know, the normal worksheet, uh, uh, normal, which is like made of six six columns. Uh, like I said, all those details, don't worry about them, all right? So uh, at the, the last chapters, they're going to be more specific to a certain things. For example, for example, you're talking about inventory. You're talking about, uh, you know, uh, how, do, how do we do the... For example, uh, the uh, the public, like let's say, if you have a, a public company, how do you deal with it as a corporation compared to if you're, if you're dealing with a private company, uh, which is like a you know, let's say for example, you have a, a company that you own uh, on your own. Uh, this is what we call sole proprietorship. And let's say if you have a company that you own with with your some of your uh, friends or colleagues or whatever, so that it could be a you know a, a partnership. And then if you have a corporation like Apple or uh, IBM or the, those are corporations, that's when you get into the stock market and the stock market is involved and we're talking about stocks. And this is something very interesting because last year, uh, some of the students were involved in stock uh, stocks. So, uh, you know, so you're probably going to be doing things uh, that you probably would never imagined. Okay, guys. So uh, I'll be very happy to see you guys uh, by the beginning of September and uh, we'll go from there okay hopefully we're gonna have a, a, a fun time in our class okay guys talk to you later and see you bye, -bye.